Welcome back to my channel. Super glad that you're here. If you still happen to be new, my name is Sasha. I do fragrance reviews, a little bit of beauty and style. So if you enjoy those types of videos, definitely take a minute to subscribe and hit that notification bell. You can also follow me on my Instagram, which is Sasha Nichols Style. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing Tom Ford's Tobacco Vanille and Chanel's Allure Sensual. And so these are some amazing fragrances and I have been wanting to try them for a very, very long time. So I was really pleased that I could try them through Royalty Scents. If you are not familiar with Royalty Scents, you definitely should check them out. It is a great place to be able to try new fragrances that you've been wanting to try. They send you a new shipment every month. Their shipping is free. They have a subscription for $19.95 a month where you pick one 8 ml bottle of the perfume sample, or you can do two a month for $36.95. You can cancel at any time. You can put your subscription on hold. There are hundreds and hundreds of fragrances to choose from for not only women, but also for men. So I'm gonna share with you the first one that I got from them, and it's really nice because it comes in this little atomizer here, and I love it. Look at how cool this is. All you have to do is twist it and it just pops right up. And then I'm already wearing it, so I'll spray a little more and then twist it, it goes back down. Now these are the 8 ml. And what's really cool, you can see I've already been wearing this. I've only had it maybe four or five days and I've been like wearing this like crazy. But there's about 120 to 150 sprays in this. So it'll last you. They have the designer fragrances to choose from and niche fragrances to choose from. Let's get right on in to Tobacco Vanille by Tom Ford. Guys, I have literally gone crazy for this fragrance. It smells so, so, so good. It is a tobacco leaf with vanilla, some ginger, and then it's got some tonka bean in there, some cocoa and dried fruit. Now this fragrance is very, very reminiscent of an old English gentleman's club. And it actually kind of reminds me of the Oak Room or the Oak Bar at the Plaza Hotel in New York. I've been there many, many times. As a matter of fact, my dad used to be the managing director of the Plaza Hotel. And that was when I was in my early 30s. So I would fly into New York and I'd get to spend some time at the Plaza Hotel. And I just remember sitting at the Oak Bar and sipping on a, on a drink and you can smell the cigar smoke and the liqueur. And so it was a really nice smell. I just, I don't know. But this is a bit on the masculine side, but it also has an alter ego because it will work for women as well. And in the dry down, this has a tendency to sweeten up a little bit. So it's not like a sugar bomb, but it's got that, the tobacco stays the entire time. You get a mild sweetness to it. It's an all around really pleasant fragrance. And I love tobacco and smokiness in a fragrance. And I think this is perfect. I don't think it's overly masculine at all. So it is a perfect unisex fragrance. As far as the performance on this, this is quite the performer. I was really, really impressed with it. It will last days and days on your clothes, on my skin, easy eight plus hours. And like I said, as it starts to dry down, it definitely sweetens up a bit. So I kept getting whiffs of this beautiful, sweet tobacco, vanilla. It's very, very nice. As far as the projection, this is definitely one that's gonna be passed in arm's length. It's gonna enter a room before you do. And I like bold, loud fragrances. I, I enjoy those types of fragrances. So. It's perfect, and then as far as the sillage, it's gorgeous, it's smoky, it's semi-sweet. It's a very powerful type of fragrance. It's all around gorgeous, I love it. So definitely check that out. And I love being able to get my fragrances from Royalty Scents because no one really wants to spend a lot of money on a full bottle of perfume only to find out that you're disappointed. So this is a fantastic way to try fragrances out. Then you know what you like, what you don't like, and if you end up loving one of the fragrances you get from them, then of course you can order a full bottle at your favorite place to shop. And then all of their fragrances are authentic, which is really, really important. 
All right, the next one I'm gonna talk about is the Chanel Allure Sensuelle. And this one is also really nice. You can see the atomizer on this one is a different color. Again, just twist it, pops up. And again, you can see the perfume inside. And they send you a new one every month. So if you order different fragrances, you'll get a new one of these with every fragrance you order. And I think that it's really nice. And they're super easy to travel with. Throw them in your bag and you're good to go. And like I said, 120 to 150 sprays. But this is a really, really nice fragrance too. Now I have smelled the original Allure uh, by Chanel and I really, really like that one. And this one is a bit more on the spicy side. It's definitely a bit more intense and it does have a little bit better performance than the original one. It's warm, it's spicy, it's a bit woody. Now in the top notes on this, you're getting patchouli, pink pepper, peach, mandarin, orange, and some bergamot. Really nice notes in this. And then in the middle, there's the Turkish rose, Bulgarian rose, iris, jasmine, and some dried fruits. You do pick up a little bit on that dried fruit, which I like. And then of course the rose in this is not overpowering, but you are gonna get a little bit of that rose. But like I said, it's not like in your face rose. And I don't like fragrances that are too much rose. I, I just, I get a headache from that, but this is done perfectly. And then in the base, there's the patchouli, vanilla, some spices, sandalwood, vetiver, labdanum, and also some lavender and amber. Now, in the original, there is some cedar, peonies, and lotus flower. So that is probably the difference between the two, but most of the notes are fairly the same. But this, as far as performance, is a bit better. The other one, the original is good too, but this one lasts a really long time. I would say on my skin, six to eight hours on the clothes. It does very nice. It lasts a day or two. And then as far as the projection, this is about an arm's length. This one is not quite as loud as the tobacco vanilla. It's a little more subtle. It's got a beautiful sillage. It's very feminine. It's a very likable fragrance. It smells very similar to the original for sure. But it's all around really, really, really nice. So again, I hope that you will look at Royalty Scents if there's some fragrances that you want to try. But again, you don't want to commit to buying a full bottle, definitely look into this company. I think they're fantastic. I always get excited when I see that my shipment has arrived and you get to pick what perfumes you want. You can even do that in a year in advance. You can pick what you want for January, February, March, April, May, June, etc., etc. So I will put the link to their website in the description box. I really appreciate you guys watching this video today. Enjoy the rest of your day and stay beautiful. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you know the next time that I upload. See you soon.